Hi guys and welcome to the McLaren Technology Center. You probably only can see the famous lake behind us because there are a couple of things that we are not allowed to show you. But what are we allowed to show? And what well, are we going to do here today here in general? Well, today we're here just to meet with the McLaren crew um, to talk about the Apex Taxi program, the relationship that we have, build on that and find the way forward of how we're going to basically work together, promote things and uh, yeah, work on the future of basically this really cool cooperation as I see it, you know. Yeah. Um, one thing that we spoke about before is that we're running the Apex Taxi as something that we see as something we love and something we enjoy. Mm. It's a program that we feel is representing the cars that we want to drive, the cars that we love to drive, and it's not necessarily running the cars that um, are the most cost effective or the cheapest or anything like that, but the cars that we really love. And as we come here to McLaren, we're getting to see about the precision, the attention to detail that, we, that, that McLaren possesses and um, really see how that works in with our taxi program mm -hmm. from the maintenance, the mechanics to um, just really every aspect of running 1,200 plus laps a year on the Nordschleife yeah. with a single car, making sure that day in and day out it's 100% ready to go, making sure that the team's ready to go, the team's fully prepared and um, there's a lot of moving parts yeah. and we think that we have a lot of moving parts you come somewhere like this the technology center and you're just blown away they were just <laughs> explaining to me that all these trophies that you see on both sides here these are all of the original trophies from every race that mclaren has ever been in they're the originals the drivers actually keep a copy and they part of their contract is that they give the originals to mclaren oh. so they say that i see that as a team sport just like how we are always talking about the apex team and um how everyone has to be working together, cohesion, and uh, so like I said, for us, it's a really good way to come here, see how the and the world they built this. Because I mean, like, like <laughs> I, I think said, Maximus car. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we're talking about moving parts, right? Yeah. I, I don't even know. I, I wouldn't even want to begin to build that. I saw something about how they build it with 3D models and put everything together, and then just thousands of hours of actually building it. Two thousand. Two thousand. There you go. Two hundred eighty thousand bricks, but. Like I said, the whole idea here is to come in, see how does this entire team work together. The massive facilities, we've got wind tunnels behind us, Formula One cars being built behind us at the same time that road cars are being built, prototypes are driving around. Mm -hmm. It's a massive operation. I think something for us that we get to see and learn, okay, you know, what we're doing is advanced and a lot going on, but man, does it pale in comparison to what McLaren's actually doing, so. Yeah, yeah. excited. Well, let's get along with the tour. All right, sounds good. So now we're walking down from the technology center into the production center. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to show anything in the uh, production center because this is where they actually have the assembly lines. They have teams of people working. We're probably going to see maybe some prototypes or just different variations of cars that are being mm -hmm. built, even customer cars and things like that that we may not want to put on film. But uh, right now we're basically going in the tunnel that connects the two buildings, which I think is pretty cool. Yeah, it's, 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 kind of, it's kind of a neat feeling, I mean. It's really impressive. Yeah. It feels yeah. as if yeah. you're going into a certain area that's a bit of <laughs> off limits, <laughs> mythical. Yeah, it's like, pretty neat. You know, like the Nürburgring slogan is Entdecke dem Mythos in yeah. my German. <laughs> no, I think it's, I think it's like I said, a really, a really neat feel when you walk through here. You've got the, the stainless steel, the high gloss white. I mean, it's really, it's really cool. No carbon fiber. Yeah. No surprised. carbon fiber, yeah. Mm. All mm. milk cars. Oh, what's that? Never been done before is a reason to go ahead, not a reason to stop. Don't follow the crowd, let the crowd follow you. <laughs> <laughs> Instagram inspirational post of the day, huh? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> having two GoPros and the phone because I want to film accelerate. Should I get my phone out too? Oh uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> and we have Tom Stamp and Diana standing trackside over there. <laughs> with the instructor that was out with me. I have no clue where this track goes. <laughs> I think aim for the helicopter. Yeah, I mean, I told him, I said, I was like, dude, 
I was like, um, I'm used to this little narrow track where, you know, you just basically follow it or you crash, you know? <laughs> yeah. Or follow it till you crash, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's actually a really cool track. Yeah, it's nice, it's very high speed. Yes, it is. This one actually has its own appeal because it's really cool. Because you go pretty fast through the corners. <laughs> right, so maybe we should say a couple of things. Okay, so so probably first of all, let's start with the most important thing. A lot of people probably ask themselves by now, but uh, at this video, at this point, did you order a car for yourself? No, not today. <laughs> <laughs> we actually had a lot of fun. Um, today we went and it was about meeting with McLaren and talking about taxi program, how to benefit the relationship, how to basically take it further, um, what to do. And uh, we had a lot of fun with that. It was really nice. It was very productive. Good meetings with the McLaren team. And then from there we went and... Um, had a little tour of the facilities, which was really cool. It's yeah. been three years since I've been there, so I really enjoyed that. Uh, and then I don't think, you know, no one else obviously had been there before, so it was really neat for us all to kind of experience it and see what everything was about. So after we did all that, then we got to come here to the Dunsfold, which is known as the Top Gear Test Track. Have a little bit of fun, play with the 600 LT, because we don't get to do that ever. <laughs> yeah. And uh, like I said, I'm lost. I don't know where the hell I'm going, but I'm having fun doing it. <laughs> Just driving in circles. <laughs> so what did we learn today? <laughs> well, we learned that the um, 600 LT is a blast on any track, right? Yep. And I think that everyone had a good time at the McLaren facility. At least I hope so. I mean, for me, it was great. Tiffany got to come, which it's very rare that she gets to come to these things. So that's really nice. Yep. Um, and then we just got to come out here and uh, play with some cars with some cool people. The entire McLaren team is really cool, really fun people. They have good food. Oh yeah, Mr's <laughs> vlog will show you all that with the food shots, right? <laughs> That's very important. And then, uh, yeah, we got to go out and spend some of McLaren's brakes and tires here with a little bit of, little bit of track time, right? <laughs> yeah. We also learned that they built roughly 24 cars per day. 20, is that what it is? Yeah, 22 Sport Series and two Senna's okay. currently. What are they doing with the 720 Spider and everything? Uh, I think they come out of one of the 22. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah, okay. I think so. And by June, I believe, all the Senna's will be done and then it's time to build the speed tail. Cool. I very much like that every car gets put on a dyno and like performance test, yeah, the dynamic neat, test, and then the monsoon test. Yeah, you saw that, that was like... Yeah, it goes 16,000 liters of water you in know six you minutes. you should have done in your vlog is just gone and stood in there and like, <laughs> let, it, let it spray you down. <laughs> So no, definitely, definitely big thank you to McLaren for letting us out today, letting us have a little bit of fun. And uh, yeah, I can't complain, huh? Yeah, yeah, no, it was awesome. M Being McLaren safe. Tours, is this something that people can just go and do? or is uh, it Generally, this right here would be like you would go to your dealer and you would go talk to them and say, hey, I'm interested in the car. Uh -huh. um, what kind of experience can you get? Um, what kind of experience can you get me so that I can get a feel for the car? Um, and basically, they would, your dealer would book you your dealer would book you into this program and get you set up with it, so. Yeah, this is for the driving, but the, like a factory tour, is this? Oh, fa oh factory tour, yeah. the sa same thing. Your dealer, would, your, dealer would do the, your dealer would do the same thing. They would book you for the factory tour. Mm -hmm. um, the space, spaces are very limited, like I said, yeah. over, the, over the years. Um, um, for us, it's been, over the years, it's really gotten busier and busier and busier, you know? And um, when I went in 2016, it was uh, a lot quieter than it was today. When I went there today, it was I was really shocked how many people were there. But, you know, they handled it well. The hospitality there is wonderful. You get to go in. You get to go down the boulevard. They usually have a lunch for you. Then you go into uh, actually into the production center where they're building the cars. And that's just an amazing sight to see all by itself. You mm -hmm. know, when you go there and see that, you're like, they use every square inch of that place. And yeah. they say they're at 
not quite 100 percent capacity but 98 percent capacity yeah because yeah. you saw you could have like used a crane and set three more cars in yeah, there, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but uh they're, they're really doing it to a science and um the thing that i appreciate is how detailed everything everything is detailed down to you know the centimeter this car goes here it comes down this line you could go in that production facility and eat off the floor. It's that cool. That's that actually great. what Tom says. Uh, I would be eating off the floor. I don't care. <laughs> just because he's like, why do I need a, a canteen? I'll just eat right here. <laughs> yep. Yep. Cool. Good. All right. Well, like I said, tons of fun. Great. Fantastic car. And uh, like I said, thanks to McLaren for letting us go out and play around, even though we didn't know where the hell we were going. <laughs> <laughs> but it was fun. It was fun. It was, uh, cool. Right on. Yeah. Let's right. go. Yeah.